All right, guys, welcome back to Two Broke Euro Owners. Uh, we are in Cody's uh, wife's car. We're going to be showing you how to program a key to the car. This is for a B7 Audi A4. Uh, works in other ones too, but sometimes you have to change which module you open to do it. Uh, and we're just programming it because we want to be able to use the buttons again to unlock the doors, lock the doors, all that stuff. All right, so the key used to be programmed to the car. They had to unhook the battery, uh, so it lost the memory for the key. So now we have to go back into the into VAGCOM, go back into the module to reprogram it. Also, if you ever take the battery out of these keys, uh, it'll also lose the programming. When you put a brand new battery in it, you just have to do this all over again. It's easy, as long as you have the VAGCOM. Um, if you have two keys, you can do it where you have your other key in the door and one in the ignition. And I forgot exactly how you do it, but there's a way you can have it programmed the, the car that way. Um, but we're just going to show you the way I do know how to do it with just one key and VACOM. So come on in the car, I'll show you how to do it. All right, so put your key in your ignition. Put accessories on. Open up VCDS. Also want to reiterate that I'm not responsible or we are not responsible for anything that happens to your car. All right, go to Central Convenience 46. Once your module opens up all the way, go into Adaptation, hit your drop down, go into Remote Control Adaptation. All right, so now this is your stored value is zero because you have no keys um, uh, in the memory for the car. You, know, you want to wait till this thing pops up. It just kind of gives you a walkthrough on what to do. Found that it's a little funky. I don't really listen to that. Um, once it's open, just close it out. Get rid of it. So your new value is going to be how many keys you want to program. And since we want to program one key, we are going to go up one. Program one. Once that is there, you want to hit the unlock button or lock button, either or. Hold it. If you notice that just went to recognized. Now that it's recognized, you want to hit save. Are you sure you want to do it? Yes. Now, back out of the controller. Back right out of it. Now, you take your key out. Test it. Here to lock and the unlock. There you go. It's as easy as that.